Well, it's doing it again. It's always at like this point. So for about a week now, I've been dealing with some field prints on my Elegy Neptune 4 Max, and I think I finally figured out why. Uh, the Z-Rod, and I'll show you what I'm talking about, um, there's a little a bracket on there that um, is, is normally loose. It comes from the factory loose and on purpose. You don't want it to bind up and it can cause some Z-wobbling and some Z-lines in your, issue, in your print. Um, but what ended up happening was it came too loose and the entire gantry wouldn't lift up on one side. So let me show you what I'm talking about. So this little turkey fart, that little bracket down there, that guy with the little screws, yeah, it came too loose. And when whenever it would Z-hop, you would see the, the motor and the rod go up and down, but you wouldn't see the gantry actually move. I had to sit here and, and stare at it for a while and watch this thing not move, but that side move. So that side would go like this, and then this side would just stay set, you know, where it's at. So I tightened those screws up a little bit, not a ton, because I don't want it to bind up and cause issues. But so far on this print, I haven't noticed any of the issues I had on the previous two or three prints. So um, I think I figured out what the cause was. It was uh, driving me nuts, but I, if, you're, if you're having the same issue, and I'm gonna tie in some photos and videos so you kind of see what was co what was causing the issues or what issues I was having. And then from there you can diagnose the same issue and uh, hopefully fix it. Now I did re-slice this file several times just to double check that it wasn't my slicing software. Maybe there's some sort of glitch in the, in the G code. So I've experienced the same issue. Just double check everything, make sure all the nuts and screws and, and sometimes just stare at your printer and, and see if you can figure it out. Hope this helps. Good luck everyone.